Hi, good evening. Welcome to A Few Minutes Tobacco. Why a few? Because I don't know yet how long it will take. This is an overview of all the burnout snuffs and schmalzlers and nasal tobaccos. Uh, this video is in for, for those people who don't want to sit and uh, listen to the lot of blah blah, right? That should be a short overview of all all burnout products and I put it into a certain order. This makes sense somehow. We start with the left upper corner. Here it is, Echt Altbayerischer Schmalzler. This is a real Schmalzler. There is no blah blah, very natural bit sour, of course, Schmalzler, as it should be. No discussions. Next is the Schmalzler Franzel Original. This one is more or less the flagship um, Schmalzler of Bernard. This is, I think, the oldest one. Very popular, very famous. Has a bit of the sweet tamarind aroma and also typical. The Bernard is using quite a lot of vinegar for flavoring or also as part of their of their casing and if you remove if you remove the sweet tamarind then you get something like the Schmalzel Franzel Fresco which is a uh, less it's not so sweet yeah I don't even think they are so similar in taste but how come on hmm. they want it, they 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 want you to believe it Regensburger Prise. It's a Schmalzler with a green apple aroma and uh, again it's mixing quite well with with this uh, vinegar that is added. This is maybe not that sour. You give it a bit of time uh, until this top flavoring disappears and it's quite an acceptable snuff. Sorry Schmalzler. Hi. That's the Kloster Mischung. This one is a Schmalzler with a rum aroma, quite herbal. Not nah, herbal is maybe the wrong word. Maybe a bit um, woodsy, smoky. Nah, I don't like it. Yeah, I'm not a fan of this. It doesn't mean that it's bad. I'm just somehow it it doesn't it, it doesn't tick my boxes. Okay. It has a, a rum aroma, so maybe it's interesting for those who are alcoholics. Winterprise. <laughs> That's um, this is Schmalzler with uh, gingerbread flavoring. Very good for for winter. Just as you know, look at the picture. Fits very well. Mm, it smells excellent. Yeah, it's really nice. Bernard Magic Moments. It's one of the dry Schmalzlers. Very dark very dark tobacco and it's flavored with um, with strawberry and uh, kind of a vanilla kind of flavoring has a bit of a dry fruit dried fruit dried raisins or dried figs or something like this dates um, flavoring it's quite nice some people like it it's sweet this one's really sweet it's uh, sweeter than the others maybe as sweet as the winter breeze. Postillion, here we come to, um, a, well, this is nearly like a snuff. I, li I quite like this somehow. Again, one of these comparably dry ones. Mm. Has It starts at the beginning, it starts with a quite extreme uh, sourness. And as soon as it disappears, you get a very nice base flavoring. Uh, quite sweet, quite molassy. <laughs> yeah, it's not bad. Here, this is a, a mix of uh, Snuff and Schmalzler, Zwiefacher. No, the guy doesn't beat the woman up. This is a dance. Yeah, it's a slight, slightly mentholated. Very, very pleasant. Actually, it's funny. I, I like, I like these 50-50 um, things. You know, like the Bayern Prise or the Zwiefacher is not bad. So if you cannot decide or you want to transition from Snuff to Schmalzler, this one is nice. But it's medicated, mentholated. Now comes the next row. We have here the Kovnoa, <clears throat> one of those very natural, old-fashioned nasal tobaccos. It's not a snuff 
uh, in terms of, uh, you know, with an additional flavoring, this is really just tobacco plus water plus a bit of oil or fat, Vaseline. It smells super good. It, this is like the Irish flake. This is like pipe tobacco Irish flake, okay? So if you're a pipe smoker, you will love these. Yeah, the Kovnoor, the Alt Offenbacher, again a tad sweeter. Oh, it's, it, it, I don't know what they put inside. Okay, that's only tobacco. It smells excellent. These are my favorites, really, these three, the Civet. Uh, with a cigar, cigar leaf flavoring, natural of course, excellent. Now comes snuff with a flavor. Bernard F. Original, this is uh, flavored with uh, pine oil. Pine oil, so this is like the pine wood ice, just... Um, it has a bit of a... It has a bit of a Latakia uh, kind of burnt Latakia flavoring quite interesting it's like really like a burnt burnt wood <clears throat> and of course pine 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 chadimari this one is um, cherry flavored snuff um, so to speak the celtic talisman of bernard has a bit of a cooling effect if i remember right it's slightly uh, oh, slightly mentholated <laughs> yeah yes it is this has menthol uh, Mostrinha um, <clears throat> is also mentholated less than the Charivari, yeah? uh, also nice dark base. Yeah. Oh, this smells fantastic. This is, uh, I think there's a good snuff here. With a very, very faint, uh, not faint, not a, not a really strong, not a really strong menthol flavoring and a nice base tobacco, really good. Polarprise, very similar, maybe a tad more, a tad more menthol, and this one also has a kind of a Latakia, Latakia flavoring, very woodsy. Mm, smells good. <clears throat> Bernard Steife Prise, Steife Prise means a strong wind. <laughs> this one is a peppermint menthol and. Yeah, peppermint, menthol, and eucalyptus. So that's <clears throat> maybe this is the, the most English one of, of Bernard. This is really an English one. Actually, it looks like it. Eh? Mm -hmm. And now come three, which are super similar, and I, I still suspect that they are the same, in my opinion. I'm pretty sure these three are the same. Bernard Schmalzler Weißblau is not a Schmalzler. Jubileum Snuff. And the Wiesen snuff, they are basically, in my opinion, totally identical. I don't believe that they are different. Maybe, maybe, maybe there is something like a little bit more of a certain aroma added, but I think this is all the same. Yeah. Ah, that's the same stuff. Come on, guys. No bullshit. Here we have these three, and then <laughs> so uh, what about this? Yeah, this is just like highly mentholated, very strong mentholation. Camphor, quite boring. I mean, sorry. The, these four are very similar. The Bernard Steife Prise being a bit more interesting because it has eucalyptus. And then here we have two without <laughs> without alcohol. I nearly said without tobacco. Magic moments white. You want to see how it looks like? Imagine you take this somewhere on the subway. <laughs> it's sweet, it's sweet. So this, the the, the, the drip it, it causes, it's really pleasant. <laughs> Always clean your nose afterwards. And the ice crystal is basically the F original without tobacco. I tell you one thing, my opinion, this one is awful. Okay, so that's all. I hope it helps. <laughs> if you have any questions, I nearly reviewed all of them. What's missing is Klostermischung, 
are the two Schmalz Lofranzels are missing and uh, the Amostrinia Steife Prise they will come so thank you for watching have a nice evening or day and if you have any questions comments let me know just write I answer okay thank you so much goodbye